Welcome to EA Sports live coverage of this friendly. So without further ado, we're off to the stadium. Your commentary team, Martin Tyler and Alan Smith. Hi there, everybody. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith is with me. And it's a friendly game on the agenda for us today. Do you think we'll get some tempo to the game today? It's billed as a friendly. Well, I hope so. I mean, that's something. if there's no tempo to it, Martin, it'd be a waste of time. So that's something the managers will be after. Here's the kickoff, and the game is underway. O'Donnell, back to him again. You can understand his eagerness to try and get in. They're holding a high line, but he's offside. Siggy Rushveld is coming forward with some danger. Thought more would have come from that, you know. Corner kick given. If all the offsides are like that for the assistants today, they'll be pretty happy because that was so straightforward. Well, I think the defence will hope that those forwards continue in that vein and don't use the brains. This is Siggy Rushveld. Oh, lost possession here. And O'Donnell. And ball there, and the play is called back. Could be dangerous. He's tried that. Absolutely no trouble for the goalkeeper here to save that shot from distance. Showing it's a physical game when it's a fair one too, and that's a great challenge. And O'Donnell. This is the chance. It's a poor touch and the possession's gone away. Malloy. This is Siggy Rushveld. And that struck his hand, and the referee's given it deliberate handball. Yeah, he's in a good position as well, the ref, just a couple of yards away. Easy one for him. The opposition back off, they could be in trouble. And the ball gets to here. The interceptor has got the ball here. Play on, says the referee. Where you want to try and get control in midfield, and they've got the ball. But 
got to time his run a little better than that, trying to get in behind the defender. Interception there was key, really, to the side that's having to defend at the moment. Malloy. And the referee points for a goal kick. And the player hasn't had to move very far to get that ball. Well, he tried to find his man, but he's only put the ball into touch no wasting of time in that situation Official has indicated three more minutes. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. And in goes the cross. And there is the half-time whistle. Nil-nil at the break. It's been gripping, hasn't it? The way these teams have gone about their business. Uh, very much as predicted and nothing to separate them as yet their level at half time yeah intriguing contest you look at the two sets of players and uh, they are evenly matched you can't say there's one team better than the other and, and that's the way it's panned out so we've reached half time and the game is scoreless let's take a look back at the highlights from that first half and then we'll be straight back to your commentary team for the rest of the match Substitutions at this stage, a key moment really, and the manager deciding to bring this player on to try and tilt the match which is level in their favour. That's a real tussle for the ball. Good handling of the shot by the goalkeeper. And the referee's given the uh, offside against Carew. Yeah, and I think defensively, uh, they were. There was good communication across that back line. They all pushed up as a team. That's going to be used. This uh, stoppage in play to have a substitution for both sides here. He's got the ball. Trying to open up the defence with that through ball. The defence wouldn't be opened up, though. Manager thinking for the away side. Time for a change.
Yeah, he's gone too early. He's offside. But it is time for change. Time for change for both teams, as it seems. On the attack here. He is the Governor General of this team. Dangerous moment. They've got the ball in the middle of the pitch here. He's in at goal. they've got the ball back what can they do from here that's poor at the throw he's thrown it straight to the opposition It's a return ball. O'Donnell. And we're into the last five minutes. That's a foul, it's a free kick. John Carew. And off he goes again, he's offside again. So many chances here, and even though there are only minutes to go, you still can't predict the outcome. Into the attacking third. Not easy to get the ball like this in midfield. You need a player with a bright mind, and he's done that, this player. And the verdict is another four minutes of added time. And O'Donnell. That's a decent challenge by the opponent. With the scores level. Golden goal rule applies today. So the side to score first in the extra period will get the prize, we will get the result, we will get the victory. The opposition back off, they could be in trouble when the ball gets to here. And here's a shot now. A corner to be taken. Can they turn it into a golden goal? Well, when the corner came in, you thought maybe, but it hasn't worked out that way. He read it and cut it out. Well, this could have ended his game. He seems to have pulled a muscle. This is Siggy Rashveld. That's oh, a great chance. Could be a goal. What a chance. Goal. Golden goal. That's the winner. Well, we had plenty of uh, extra time to go. We didn't need much of it, Alan. Golden goal straight away. Yeah, they seem determined to get this finished with as soon as possible. They came out the traps the quickest in extra time and deserved it. Well, that was something special, a golden goal finale. Alan Smith and Martin Tyler, we've been with you. 
before all that excitement. We'll be with you next time as well. Goodbye for now. So it's all been resolved in that period of extra time. Always a dramatic way to find a winner, but at least we didn't have to go through the lottery of penalties today. I'll leave you with the full match highlights, and until next time, I've been Jeff Stelling. Bye for now.